today I'm going to try out Windows 8 Milestone 3 Build 7955 which was compiled on 28th of February 2011 and leaked on the 25th of April 2011. Mum has previously tried out Windows 8 Developer Preview Build 8102 released on the 13th of September 2011. Windows 8 Milestone 3 was never meant to be seen by the public. On Windows 8 Milestone 3, the windows are transparent and rounded, just like Windows 7. Unlike in the developer preview, where they are still transparent but square. But in the final release, they were square with no transparency. However, the title is centred like in Windows 8, unlike in Windows 7, where the title is left aligned. In Windows 8 Milestone 3, the file explorer is the same as in Windows 7, but it has an up button and a bar along the bottom and the details are now on the right instead of on the bottom. However, it does not have the ribbon UI that Windows 8's file explorer has. It also has some new folder icons that were later scrapped. Windows 8 Milestone 3 has a profile picture in the bottom right corner which is not in Windows 7 or 8. In Windows 8 Milestone 3 the start button looks the same as it does in Windows 7. However it brings you to a start screen. In Windows 8 Milestone 3 you drag down from the top left corner to show all programs unlike in the final release where you right click on the start screen and then click all apps. Windows 8 Milestone 3 also has a predecessor to the charms bar where you drag down from the top right corner. Windows 8 Milestone 3 also have a predecessor to the Windows 8 settings app which contains shutdown options unlike the final release where the power options are under the settings charm. In Windows 8 Milestone 3 also has a task manager which is crossed between the Windows 7 Task Manager and the Windows 8 Task Manager. When Windows 8 Milestone 3 crashes, it has a black screen with white text. Unlike Windows 7, it has a dark blue screen with technical information. And unlike Windows 8, which has a light blue screen with a sad face. Let's check it out. Welcome to OS First Timer, episode number, don't know, um, let's go and see what it's all about. It's a cold wintry day, even though it's spring, but we're having a very wintry spring this year. That looks like it's one of those games and you move the letters around or something. I'm going to tread carefully through the jump room. Shh, not, let's not leak our hard work. Microsoft Confidential. Unauthorised use or disclosure in any manner may result in disciplinary action up to and including termination of employment in the case of employees, termination of the assignment or contract in the case of contingent staff and potential civil and criminal liability for test purposes only. Windows 8 milestone 3 build 7955 2011 what's the time? 1703 read the Microsoft Confidential I've read that already write save and open a text don't know I'm not reading the other things yet because I don't want to be I don't want the excitement to, or something like that Desktop, will that tell me? No, that won't tell me where to find things. Looking for a text document. Try computer. 
documents. That's only where they're filed. So I need the office things. Right. So I'm not finding this easy yet. Control panel. Search. That's not really what I want. General. Ease of access. I need that. Well, that didn't make it easy. Well, I don't, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do a document. I can go to the documents and open them, but I can't make a new one. I can't find the normal stuff. I don't know then. I've tried all those things. Do it. That doesn't do. Document right, there we go. Looks more like a printer there. Let's have a look, see if there's anything here. This is all settings there. Unintuitive. Well, let's see if it's got any hidden things. Whoa. I don't know. I can't do that one, trying to not calculate. No, I can't find office. How about search? Can you search? Office. Office. Nothing happened. Usually that brings everything up. Search computer. No, I really can't do it. Can't do that. Change the window colour. See if I can do that then. Gadget. So put it in the gadget. For the documents. Right, I'll we'll try what else might be. Change the window colour. Personalise, I'll try that. Yes. Window colour. The edging changing. Well, I don't know if that means if that's the right thing, but there we go. Change your profile picture. Oh, but it says Stefan, not Debbie. Change that little pen. Choose your own task. Oh, I did see some games, didn't I? Gadgets it was. Was that the start? Oh, 
other programs. Uh, um, for me that's tricky. Not at all. I can't remember, can't remember where gadgets were. I haven't even found that yet. I found notepad. I'll have to do it. No. Okay, right, I did that. Now I might find the gadget. We'll save as, yeah. Oh, it's going to be under documents. It's going to be. Is it 196? Save. Oh, I'll go reopen it. I'll go here. Try that. Documents. Oh, yeah. It's the only document in there. Hello, welcome to OS First Time at NZ episode 196. Windows 8, milestone 3. Bill, oh, it doesn't show up. Build 7955 2011. This is somewhat um, uh, unregible. No, un, unintuitive. Debbie Grace, 8th September 2019. Well, it's not my favourite of operating systems. So I've known a calculator. So I've got to go to that gadget, you think? So I've got to go back there, I think. So I've got to go back to this page to start it. It's along the bottom, which are always beneficial. And I can't remember where I found the gadgets, because I looked through so much. I'm looking. There it is. 22.5 times 4.7. One oh five point seven five. Let's not leak. Oh, how do I don't even know what word the letters would make Q in it, but no U. Choose my own task. That's going to be the gadgets, but I don't know where to find them. I wonder where I found the control panel. We're under apps. I don't see that either. Startup screen. That's the startup screen. Nice, nice background. I wonder where I'm just going around in circles here. Somewhere I had gadgets. I remember which I saw on the gadgets. I wonder what this lot is and how to get to it. Try this. The puzzle thing. And the other one, I don't know where it's got to. Internet black gammon. Almost one of those little word puzzles. But I can't remember where the gadget. This clear disk diameter devices and printers. Desktop gadget gallery. Oh, well, there we go. Picture puzzle. Well, it's a bit small. We increase its size. And do that to drag it. Options. But there are no options for different puzzles. Thank you. 
Done it. Took me five minutes and 32 seconds. Right. Currency. Cannot connect to service. Okay. Right, see if I can find it. Silly page of other thumb. Oh, that was. No. Still on the wrong page. That's the one. Oh, goodness. Oh, that's different to the one I play. I'm sure mine's called Spider Solitaire. How to, oh, how to play, and I missed it. Can't do anything I'm good at for. Oh well. It's not. Do you want. What do you want to do with the game? I don't want to save it. Right, so that would be the end. Mm -hmm. Oh, the last task. I did shut down the computer without using the power button. Yeah, it's going to check what the other game was. I can get the silly thing to do it. I saw something else about solitaire. Never mind, let's shut down without using, because that'll be a challenge. Oh look, what about that? Settings. All settings. Yep. Yeah. Do a search for shutting down. Some of them you had to go like that and drag something. You just shut the monitor up and just pretend you shut it down. Well, now I'm stuck there. <laughs> Press the Windows key. Oh, that helped. What's on here? Let's see if that little man does it. Wireless on, off. Oh, no. Shut down. Oh, yeah. Hibernate. No, shut down. Uses no power. Closes all applications. Right. Well, that was unintuitive. I'll be glad to get back to this lovely old computer.